The White House and USDA have created a new program to respond to those in agriculture which have been financially hurt by the virus. WCI3's ag reporter Stu Ellis has more in this morning's report from the farm. The Coronavirus Food Assistance Program is financed by a $19 billion fund and is substantially different from USDA's recent programs designed to indemnify farmers hurt by the China trade war. This new program will use $9 billion in direct aid to livestock producers, $4 billion for commodity crop producers, $2 billion for fruit and vegetable growers, and another half billion for farmers producing for niche markets. Another $3 billion will be used to purchase fresh produce, dairy products, and meat. The focus is to help farmers who have been dependent upon restaurants and others in food service which have been forced to close. And without a market for fruits, vegetables, meats, dairy products, those fresh products would be lost to spoilage. And millions of gallons of milk have already been dumped for lack of a market at schools, for example. So this program is not directed at corn and soybean farmers. But another program waiting in the wings will help those farmers who've seen soybean prices drop a dollar from January and corn prices drop 80 cents from the first of the year due to the recession spurred by the coronavirus. That program will be funded with $14 billion that will be distributed after July 1st and could parallel the market facilitation payments of the last two years. That's our report from the farm. I'm Stu Ellis with WCIA 3, your local news leader. Look right now at our roofing dog on and Pontiac RV weather camera that is now beginning to brighten up here and across Pontiac and Livingston County just a few days ago. Back on Friday, if you remember, we were looking at snow falling on the ground here and it's not the case here. And over the weekend, it did warm up and started to become a bit more comfortable. We're going to be comfortable again, I would say, today. Still probably slightly below average, but sunshine is going to help out. Satellite radar picture, things pretty clear for now. We have more.